Good evening and welcome to the programme. When the government's benefit reforms were brought in this year, there were concerns that hundreds of families would have to move out of the capital because of the high cost of housing. Now, one coastal town is calling on London councils to stop moving benefit claimants to the south coast because of a shortage of affordable homes in the capital. Hastings says around 100 households have been moved to the area from Newham, making it harder to revive the town's economy. Plenty more ahead this Friday evening, including seven hospitals in and around London are to have their links with Jimmy Savile investigated. Thames Water has revealed it has been given the go-ahead to defer £20 million a year in tax liabilities while it continues to upgrade London's ageing pipe network. The firm is at loggerheads with the regulator Offwatt over its plans to raise customer charges despite soaring profits. Its latest plan will see its deferred tax bill rise to more than £1 billion. She says it was a gamble and she was only ever expected to live until the year 2000. But Tinica Dixon has outlived her own expectations and those of her doctors. 25 years after having a heart and lung transplant at Great Ormond Street Hospital, she went back there today to meet the team who saved her life. Tinica Dixon with her incredible story there. Still to come tonight. Sacred soil collected from 70 Belgian battlefields arrived in the capital today, transported along the Thames on a Navy frigate. It will be used to create a unique memorial garden at Wellington Barracks to mark the 100th anniversary of the Great War. Aisha Baksh has the story. Now, she was a flamboyant and influential figure in the fashion world. Isabella Blow was credited with launching the careers of designer Alexander McQueen and milliner Philip Tracy. Now, Somerset House is holding an exhibition looking back at the life and wardrobe of a woman whose legacy continues to inspire fashion. Peter's got the weather for us, and how is it looking for this weekend? Riz, the stars are coming out. And that's it for now. Thanks very much for joining us. Chris Rogers will be back with our late news. From me and the team here, though, whatever you're doing, have a wonderful weekend. Bye-bye.